Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle and styling. Today I have five skirts you should have in your wardrobe as a tall woman. Struggle is real when trying to find clothes to fit our frames. But it's certain pieces that will make getting dressed a lot easier and here are some of my favorite pieces that I think you should have in your wardrobe as far as skirts. Satin skirts. So satin skirts are those items that can actually be dressed up or down. And for tall women, what looks really good on us are maxi skirts or even a midi skirt. It's kind of hard going between maxi and midi depending on the brand that you get your skirts from. But sometimes the midi is not so midi on us <laughs> and the maxi is not so maxi. The goal is to find something that's at your knee or a little bit below your knee. And then for maxi at like at minimum your ankle anything higher than that would still to me will be like a midi skirt i have two in my wardrobe that are kind of like a-line style and a-line skirts are really amazing on our frames because a lot of us are bigger at the top like most of us have broader shoulders or at, or an athletic build typically softer materials look really good on us so satin skirts should be in your wardrobe get multiple colors i would always recommend getting a black and like a nice neutral color and I'll show you guys some videos of me with mine on. The reason why I'm saying that is because you can wear them so many ways and the goal is to always get the most out of your clothes. I've said this before and I'll say it a ton of times. As tall women, it is hard for us to find things and sometimes you don't really want to put that out there like, oh, it's so hard for us to find clothes, but that's just the reality of it. We like oversized stuff too, but most of the time the average height girlies, I'll be grabbing onto the stuff before we can get to them. And then you have those that are wearing women's clothes, right? <laughs> so you guys know what I mean. So we have to get out there a little bit earlier as opposed to everyone else because of our size and the items are going fast. Get a black one and definitely get something that is neutral. The second style of skirt you should have in your wardrobe are denim skirts. Okay. Denim is on trend right now, so it's on trend, but it's never been out of style, if that makes sense. People are wearing them in the fall with boots, or you can wear them with some slides, which I absolutely love in the spring. And definitely once fall hits, I'm sure the ladies are gonna be wearing them with boots and sneakers and anything else they could actually put them with. Oh, you can wear chunky boots with them if you wanna go for that style. There's so many things you can actually do with a denim skirt. So you can wear Chelsea boots, you can wear ankle boots, you can definitely wear knee boots, any of those boots, sneakers, <laughs> Anything can actually go with denim skirts. They're really good to have in your wardrobe. Just go for a color that, that can be worn a lot, right? So light wash doesn't really look good in the fall or in the winter, but if you get something like a medium wash, you can definitely get your cost per wear. And ladies, I don't care how many times I say this, as tall women, we have to get our cost per wear because we cannot find the stuff as often as we would like to. So it's best to go for something that's great quality and something that you can actually wear multiple ways especially when it's something like these pieces that I'm mentioning because that way you can have them for season after season. Definitely go for denim skirts. Maybe get a black one as well which I'm going to show you guys too. Black is another color that can be worn a ton of ways okay. You can go for a dark crispy black one and I mean crispy like I mean like that deep dark black or you can go for something that is more of like an acid, not acid wash, but like a like a faded black because those look really good with red. It gives it kind of like an edgy look, but you could also, like I said, wear those with shoes, sneakers, boots, anything. So definitely go for blue and black denim skirts. These are just essential skirts that you should have in your wardrobe. Choose the best colors for your wardrobe. Basically, if you have a ton of satin skirts or tops, that are like neutral colors or like pop of, pops of colors, any of these skirts can go with those pieces. So you wanna grab pieces that are going to, like I said, get the best and your best cost per wear. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you to go buy the most expensive satin skirts because to be quite honest, sometimes they don't even feel that great, okay? So you wanna go for things that's really gonna make sense for your pockets and your wardrobe. Right, and the last piece would be a wrap skirt. Wrap skirts are amazing on tall women. A lot of us do have more of an athletic build or are very slim. There's not many tall women that are extremely shapely and it just could be 
how the body is made because we're longer. Wrap skirts do give off a really nice silhouette on for the girlies who have smaller hip and smaller bum areas. So definitely go for a wrap skirt. There are tons of them and you can go for even something that is ruching that also has a wrap because that also gives you some sort of shape when you are wearing the item. Those are five nice pieces that you should have in your wardrobe. If you don't have them now, definitely go ahead and get them. Satin skirts are uh, the rave. You can get a ton of colors. They're just really nice, they're very versatile, and I definitely think that they will make an impact on your wardrobe. For the girlies who do not like satin skirts, you can definitely still go for pencil skirts with pockets if that's your thing. So for the girlies who are tall, who are trying to build out their wardrobe, definitely try to get some of these pieces in there. Start now. Me, I'm always gonna keep adding to my skirt category because I like skirts. They look really nice on us and I think a lot of us should really start wearing them a little bit more. And trousers look really good on us too. So those are pieces that I would definitely keep in my wardrobe for a really long time. And they're like essential pieces so if you don't have them, definitely go ahead and try to get them. You do not have to spend a ton of money on them. But Mango, okay, Zara, the Frankie Shop, they have nice denim skirts. And you want to go for denim skirts that are denim, right? Nothing that's mixed with like elastic because it's really not going to last you for a long time. The goal is to make sure that you are getting your cost per wear and buying great quality. Another tip is to make sure you are taking your stuff to the dry cleaners because sometimes, ladies, <laughs> when we wash things, people tend to dry them and then before you know it, the item is trash. Those are some skirts that I think you should have in your wardrobe if you don't have them today. I'm basing this off of my wardrobe and how easy it is for me to get dressed. For us tall ladies, we do struggle when it comes to finding things, especially in our size. If something does fit us that's at a brand that does not cater to tall women, we definitely have to grab the pieces up. And again, if they have multiple colors, get multiple colors, okay? <laughs> Thank you guys for joining me today. If you have any questions about any of the skirts that I mentioned in here, they're all from Mango with the exception of the orange one. The orange one is from Express or Banana Republic. I'm not even sure, I'll just double check. But the rest of the, rest of the skirts are from Mango. So this is what I'm saying, that we don't necessarily have to go ahead and shop at a tall girl brand if we don't have to, especially for things like skirts. We can find skirts at regular brands that fit us and then get probably jeans or trousers from a tall girl brand. I think it's a really good idea to start with these and go from there, guys. So if you like videos like this, please comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco, we see you. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY. And my personal style blog, Coco Styles NYC and Coco Styles NY for my style services. And guys, I'm on TikTok, Coco Styles NYC. Well, Coco Styles NYC. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.